Phenom? Always watching over some communities worldwide. God bless and protect you and your loving family. Thank you, Phenom. Good afternoon, Willie. Oh, Mom Taz is here. <laughs> My video? Not yet. It paused it. Did it change the video? It's what? It changed the battery. Pause the video. Oh. Sorry, I didn't know it would do that much in 30 seconds. <laughs> Are we rocking? Being um. <clears throat> well. Yeah, okay. Let's see if I can get this set up. There we go. My bench is a disaster again. <laughs> but that's okay. We'll survive. How's everybody doing on this fine Saturday morning? Sunday afternoon or something, probably for Ozdat. <laughs> 15 hours difference, I think. <coughs> Travis. Travis! Morning, buddy. How are you? How's the weather where you're at? Is it super hot, man? It's It's hot here. Right now. It's nice right now. I wish I could be. I wish I was cutting right now. Good morning, Travis. I know it's early, but. I'm cutting in the log deck today. So I want to be cutting, and the noise ordinance in town is seven o'clock. So the saw starts up about six fifty. <laughs> Ninety every day. I'm doing great. Just got off work. Oh, right on. Wharfdale. <laughs> Good morning. Sweet cherry pie. Thanks for saying hi the other day. Oh, heck yeah, Wharfdale. <laughs> yeah, buddy. <laughs> heck yeah. I'm trying to do better, Wharfdale. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to do better with that kind of stuff. Is that Charlie? Yeah. Window. Yeah, my alarm clock. I uh, set it for three o'clock this morning, so I get up and get all my stuff ready to go, and then do the live thing, and you know, do all that. Well, somehow my alarm clock got pushed forward an hour, so. I actually woke up at four. <laughs> four oh seven is what I got. Yeah. <laughs> but my alarm clock said three oh seven. Right? <laughs> I thought, oh, I'm doing good. This is great. I'll get all my stuff ready to go, hang out with the live, look at my phone. I got no four oh seven. Dang it. <sighs> so I'm gonna spend this time uh getting saws ready to go and things packed up iPhone is not activated contact your carrier Just ignore it <laughs> why do you say that every time it comes on because I gotta let you know well, it's just ignore it because I don't know because it's not, not 
357 I got. I'm trading it for hop reported 288. What? Holy smokes, Travis. Yeah, buddy. Wow. That's a good trade. That's a really good trade. Hot Rod 288, huh? Morning, Zach. From Bellingham, Washington. Zach Meter. Welcome. Nice. Thank you. Thank you for your support. Local. Good morning. Somewhat local. <laughs> yeah, Bellingham. Right on. Can't wait to get that. Uh, that was that was quick, Travis. That's awesome, Zach. I'm glad you like the videos. I'm glad you're here. Good to see another Washington person. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Oz that. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Two eighty-eight. Oh, right on. <coughs> Does he run them, Travis? <laughs> oh boy. Goats. Start it off. Morning, buddy. <laughs> Riggins. Riggins, Idaho is. I'll, I'll look it up. I. I'll look it up. I know where it's at. I don't know how far it is from here though. Eight or ten hour eight eight or ten hours probably. I sent uh I sent snowmobile shocks to a shock shop in Riggins, Idaho. Four and a half hours away. Four and a half is all? Mm -hmm. It's only four and a half hours from here? <laughs> There's Riggins and Rexburg. Well, Riggins is four and a half hours. Wow. It's closer oh. than I thought. Tasman Canny Four. Tasman Canny Four. He doesn't run them much. Hmm. Prospects. <laughs> Mrs. Tasman. <laughs> Yeah, Goats has wound up this morning. Why is it the Mrs. Capital? Heck yeah, buddy. Heck yeah. Oh, heck yeah, we're cruising now. Kind of by McCall, Salmon River Country. Yeah, because Riggins is... Riggins is like southeast of us. How far is Riggins from you? They make good patties. Because, <laughs> well, because McCall, I think, I think McCall is farther from us than Riggins then. Because Riggins is south. <laughs> Johnny. Well, it's southeast also, because, but no, it's. It's like south of us. McCall is five and a half hours away. McCall's five and a half? Yeah. It's yeah. Just below. Yeah. Range. It's right over by, well, because McCall is just beyond Grangeville. 
So however long it took you to get to Grangeville is how long it's going to take a little bit longer to get to McCall. Ten hours from Travis. Want to do jet boat ride up the... Oh, man. It's unreal. <laughs> it is unreal. William. William DeBerry. Good morning, buddy. Still waiting on my wood. I need to do some cutting. Saying that it's hot, hot, hot. Oh, yeah, it's hot, 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 man. No doubt. <laughs> yeah, and yeah, Travis. But the way I did it was fighting fire. That's how they ran us up and down the river, chasing lightning strikes. Oh, yeah. And when you see that country, you'll be like, oh, my. <laughs> good country. It's, a, it's awesome. It's awesome. Good country. <laughs> Rocking this morning, huh, buddy? <clears throat> I hope everybody's having a good start to their day and having a good start to their weekend. Yeah, he says, Johnny Arnett, the wild man. What did Johnny say? Today I'm off work. Oh, wait, I'm sitting in the AC drink coffee. Hold on. You rock, Johnny Arnett. You really got to be careful what you're ordering, Johnny. Right? <laughs> and remembering what you're ordering. <laughs> right? It's a ticket, buddy. I know the road. Uh... Starting the day. Right on, William. I hope you have an awesome day. Goodness sakes. Boy, it was hot yesterday. <laughs> sneaky shipper. Yeah. <laughs> JK the sneaky shipper. Mm -hmm. Sneaky shipping. Sneaky shipping. <laughs> Shady shipping. Shady shipper. Shady shipper. Shady shipper. That's it. <laughs> well, yeah, oh, he got some stuff in the works for you, folks. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, I wish we'd get rain, William. You need to meet us for a jet boat ride next year, Travis says. We'll go for a jet boat ride up the, snake, up the Salmon River. Do you haul my camper? I don't care. <laughs> It's cool country. It's amazing what those boats will do. It's nuts. Stop there on the way to your river property. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Why can't you look closer? Right? Why can't Goat please move you and your river closer. This would be easy. Yeah, and just divert the river mm -hmm. this way. Start digging now. <laughs> well, I hope there's a breeze today and this morning, and hopefully it's not hot. I don't know why I'm so worried about it. I got a week to get that pile cut up. You got a lot done yesterday. Yeah, I got a pretty good start on it yesterday. Well, we could fold the map, fold the map up, and leave it to the state. Right? Yeah, bar part Tuesday, my friend. Great idea, goats. 
<laughs> this is right there. Right on, Johnny. Because you like playing with you. <laughs> right? <laughs> Then yesterday I was gonna yesterday I was gonna stop because it was getting hot. I was gonna stop. <coughs> went in the office, had a couple jugs of water, and went back out there. And I thought, well, I'll just throw this wood off the pile. No, I couldn't stand it. I had to run another saw. <laughs> and then instantly jumped in the pool when you got. Oh yeah, the pool sure felt good. I'll tell you, I ain't kidding you. I I haven't wanted to be in the water. That bad since I was a senior in high school. Daily doubles football practice. That's right, Ghost. I do like playing with chainsaws. <laughs> Just a little bit. Just a little. <laughs> And in that pile, there's something for every saw that I got. <laughs> there's smaller wood. There's bigger wood. Oh, yeah. It's good test grounds. I love cutting in a deck. You can you can figure out a lot about a chainsaw. A lot of bit. <laughs> yeah, goats. <laughs> yeah, Travis, we, we kind of all, all do, for sure. <laughs> Yeah, you can get a lot figured out. We got a new, uh, as you saw in the title of the of the live, we got we got a new addition. We got a new addition that that I'm going to try out today. I used to use this for marking, you know, and the only time I mark wood is is when I'm cutting for somebody that that could be like finicky about their, you know, the wood length or whatever. Because when I cut mine, I just eyeball whatever, 12, 14, closer to 14, you know, because that's how big my wood stove is. So that's how long I cut my wood, right? Coworkers asked if I wanted a mat this morning. I said, heck yeah, asked what it was. He said, some kind of Pro Mac. Nice. Right on, man. Even if it's parts, it's parts. So, yeah, anyway, and this this is what I've used, you know, this type of deal with a can of paint or a crayon or whatever. And another person that has a great idea and shows you how to build it and how to make it, how to build it, how it works. Travis 307 Joe has a great video of a, a wood marking setup that he that he's used and that he has his ha, had his kids use and and I'm assuming that Paula probably uses it. So go check out 307 Joe. Go check out the uh, the firewood marking video. Twelve inches from the tip. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Go go check that out. So so we got we we got something in the mail yesterday from a fantastic sub subscriber that has done a ton of stuff for this channel and for me personally behind the scenes. And he chooses to be anonymous. So, anyway, we got a new addition, and we're going to try it today. What's that link to, dear? Travis's channel. His channel? Okay. Mama Taz just put the link up to Travis's channel. Please go check out Travis. Give him some support. Keep him going. Morning, Mama Bellhopper. Mama Bellhopper. Good morning, Alyssa. Hope everything's good. Hope things are going well. Is that the 572 in front? Yes, sir, it is. Goats. I will design a wood marker that mounts on your bar, then back in the shop. Okay. 
James Wilson. Good morning, James Wilson. Welcome. Travis, I already know that I'm awesome. Thanks for joining us, James. Appreciate it, buddy. Appreciate everybody that's here. Things are going good. Awesome. Keep them rolling. Good morning. Joni Arnett, this this th this thing here, <laughs> it's gonna take some it's gonna take some time and, and, and tweaking and whatever to get it to get it right, but I think there's some ideas that could go with it. And the subscriber that sent this also has some ideas that could help it be a better tool good morning guido guido so what this is it's a laser have, have you guys seen it have you have you people seen it it's a laser that mounts on the handlebar on the oil tank side or you can mount it on the other side if you're cutting the other way also to make it easier going the other way <laughs> But it's a laser and you set it up for your length. You set it on, set your bar on a log and then you set it and then you get your tape measure or your measuring stick and you set it out there and then you just adjust it like that. And they do have a different uh, mount than the one that I have. The one that I have just bolts right onto the handlebar. And they do have another mount that is a swivel mount that has easier adjustability on it. falling laser that's one of the ideas that i'm gonna mess around with with the saw um to see if it can be adjusted to your gunning sights and it could be another another sight yeah so it mounts right there that red thing is what it is so you're so it's like that to your bar right yeah and like i said i don't i don't but for this for this log deck cutting it's going to be it's going to be primo one because it's hot and every time you got to shut the saw off, you know, sure, you got to fuel it up and whatever. I get it. But if you got to shut the saw off and then you got to go back and like yesterday and today, I'm doing it by myself. So I don't have somebody marking it for me. Right. So I have to shut the saw off, go over in the heat, mark, 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 mark logs, mark logs, cut, 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 throw it out of the way. Mark, 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 mark. Well, that mark, 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 mark time in the hot eliminated with this right it's just cut you just cut keep going run out of gas fill it up and so you're gonna it's gonna cut down it's gonna cut down in the time in the heat that's a good idea where did you get the laser well it is from it is called a firewood pro sizer and like i said go check them out Go check out their video. Go check out the way, you know, how they explain it and all that kind of stuff. And check out the different mount. Because like I said, the mount that I have is just the, it's just a bolt on, two bolts. And it just wraps around the handlebar. And it comes with some, some other rubber stuff that you can put in there if you have a smaller handlebar than what it takes to fill that gap. And their website is www.firewoodprosizer.com. Wetters Wood Products, LLC, Everson, Washington. Everson is not too far from Bellingham, I would say. The 
try to mark on your bar once. Mark 12 inches from the tip and line the line up with the end of the log, then mark the log with the tip. Small round laser that could be mounted inside the wrap handle for a sighting tool when making your first lineup cut for the notch. I think this thing would work for that too. <coughs> I think it could work as a level also. Good morning, Kevin. Good morning, Kevin. Should know lasers are not visible in some extreme lighting conditions. Yeah, this thing's bright. It's bright. I had it out yesterday in the sun. And it's it's plenty bright. <laughs> it says the battery, it says it, it's rechargeable. So we'll see how long we'll see how long the battery lasts. Because I'm sure I'm sure I'll forget to turn it off. <laughs> Tell me where the tree is going to fall. Trees can't read lean. You are good to go. Yeah, it's it's a it's a pretty good laser. We're going to try it out, like I said. And I'm going to try it with, with other stuff, you know, for as far as like level and and that kind of stuff. Just something to try. And at the wood hole, it's a great place to try it, right? Zip ties. On his hands to get the right cut. A wood yard videos. He has zip ties on his hands to get the right cut. Zip ties. Wow. <laughs> the thing, I, the thing I like about this is, is just gonna be see it, cut it. See it, cut it, instead of, you know. Kim actually woke up. Kim Wilson, good morning. <laughs> Hope you're enjoying your coffee oh, this early. Thank up. you for getting up. She's probably in bed having her coffee. Probably. Zip tie of the length he wants on his hand grip so he's cutting with this he's cutting clear then he's cutting close right i'm assuming if it's on his hand he's cutting close he's not cutting with the long bar oh hummingbird Holy crap. he tried to come in the shack <laughs> damn near died on the handle of the saw. Huh. It'll be a fun experiment. That's for sure. throttle end I think good morning Robert okay I'll look up this channel what, what channel is it in the wood yard yeah I think so yeah so we're going to start out with it on the 572 right 
where the laser is. It's 5.30 here, James. Got to get some sleep. Love you all. Have a great weekend. Make someone smile. Stay safe. Thanks, Travis. Thanks, buddy, for stopping in this morning after work. Appreciate it, buddy. Have a good sleep. Your love to Paula. <coughs> huh. Yeah, I think it's going to work. I think it's going to be handy. Handy dandy. Jay Ferris. Good morning, buddy. JK, good morning. <laughs> Shady Shippers here. <laughs> Shady Shipper. I don't understand. Does he ever cut with it? I don't know. I haven't got that far. There's a little bit of foam there. Oh, yeah, there's foam there. Yeah, no. Yeah, that. <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather mark the log with paint. Because it, because in a deck in a deck with a long bar you can't do that. Thank you, Johnny. Appreciate you, buddy. Thank you very very much. Right. Yeah, we're gonna try it, goats. We're gonna we're gonna give it a shot. Jay survived the tree job yesterday, so that's good. Oh <laughs> in, in, in the, the landfill. In the <laughs> <laughs> He's probably trying to forget about that. He's probably <laughs> still smelling that. <laughs> it's in his eyeballs. It's in my... <laughs> oh, yeah. Hard to keep some batteries in the truck. Well, that's the thing is, if if it if it if it dies, it dies because it's rechargeable. It's not. Uh, you can't, just pop you, new you can't put a new battery in it. It's set for 16 inches right now. And it's on the money. I messed around with it some more yesterday. <laughs> you know, new gadgets you can't. Dump was disgusting. I'm dry heaving just because. <laughs> 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 now I know how to get Jay. Yep. Landfill. Landfill. So you guys say. Landfill. Landfill. <laughs> 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 that would be just awful. 
like the ad watch batteries. Oh yeah, I, yeah, I'm sure in the in in the testing and in the first, yeah. And like I said, he's, there's a swivel mount too that that's going to be handy. Yeah, it's going to it's going to be awesome. Just more cut time, right? <laughs> it's all about the cut time. It is. <laughs> it's all about the cut time. <laughs> so like four feet, don't they? Swim mounts. Yeah, you could you could you could mark you could set this up. The swivel mount just makes it, it makes it a faster, easier setup, you know, because because it doesn't. I mean, it, it pulls one way, but it doesn't pull like this one. Like this one, when you tighten one bolt, you get it set, and you tighten one bolt, it will pull the laser right. It will pull the laser a little bit that way, and then you tighten the other one, and then it kind of creaks around. That swivel mount just makes it faster of a setup, faster and easier setup and if you had mounts if you just had mounts you could mount them on a bunch of saws and then just switch the laser out because the laser is adjustable also with another screw that that clamps down on it Top Josh, skinny trees are hard climbing. Yeah. Four hundred and three sixty two. Like, see, you do more cuts with both, Jay. I just cut at the end of my toes. Yes, I wear steel toes. <laughs> you need an 881 with a six foot bar for log deck work, Kenny. I know. I know, Jay. Like I said, like I told you yesterday, I thought about it a whole bunch of times. I thought, man, all these logs are lined up right at the butt. It'd be great just to hog right into that. <laughs> Is he still talking about a 92 inch bar? <laughs> six footer. Drop it on the house. I've seen leaves do more damage. <laughs> Landfill. Try working on the back dock of a chicken plant where all the scraps get thrown into the dumpsters. Oh, no. And the temperatures are scorching. <laughs> Cut one quart of wood in one shot. That's right, buddy. <laughs> do more videos with these two saws comedy central sucks anymore <laughs> <laughs> another thing i'm doing is drilling a hole in my uh, old gopro 4 cover <laughs> you gotta do that right now before so i don't forget Viking. These old these old GoPros don't uh, they don't allow enough sound <laughs> in. <laughs> so we're, we're we're gonna modify this here a little bit. See if we can't take care of that issue. <laughs> <laughs> 
You know, it's kind of muffled with the old ones with this cover on it and all that kind of stuff. The only reason I'm messing around with this is because I'm not putting the I'm not putting the tan where I'm putting this. <laughs> You're not gonna tell them. No. You want it to be a surprise? I think this is going to work fantastic. It's like a presidential modification. <laughs> it's already almost 6 o'clock. Are you taking everybody to the closet? I was thinking about it. Because I can run an extension cord out the back. That are my uh, portable. Well, either way, either way, it would be fine. And then I was thinking the little pop-up tent thing. I, I, I thought maybe, you know, we'll, we'll take a vote. And maybe, you know, maybe everybody wants to go see it. Check it out a little. I don't know. I vote one pile. Healed here. Happy birthday, Healed Heart. Oh, yeah. Happy birthday, Angie. Happy birthday. To you. I hope you have a fabulous day, Healed Heart. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for getting up early to join us on this live feed on your birthday. And I hope that cup of coffee you got is awesome. Bushman says hello to everyone, and he's on his way to the Saw Hoarders barbecue. So he's on his way to the barbecue is now? No. Saw Hoarders. Saw Hoarders? Isn't that Saw barbecue? No, he talks about it all the time. He was heading somewhere. See, yeah. I vote to do whatever you feel like. <laughs> <laughs> JK. <clears throat> Jay <laughs> escaping the womb day. <laughs> oh gosh. I gotta clean that lens. What did I miss? Had to put the dog to bed. Thank you, Taz, and everyone. I freaking love you guys. Thank you. <clears throat> we love you too, Heal Heart. Hope you have an awesome day. Laser talk? Just filled in real quick, not a long story. We got Oz that did you were you here for the uh for the wood firewood pro sizer? Turbo. 
laser talk. JK, that is unnecessary. Having a birthday is the same as celebrating the anniversary of the time your parent. <laughs> Remember, JK, we're not on my channel. No, it's not. It's different. <laughs> it's different, JK. <laughs> it's different. It's nine, that's nine months difference. <laughs> so, I've some of it. Donnie Walker was showing one a while back. Oh, right on. So, Donnie's... Is, so Donnie's carrying him too. Cool. Sure watch well, I know how it works. Oh, do ya? Oh, yeah. We're going to check it out. Did I see something? Smitty just put another video up. I'll tell you that I, I ran it and it was, you know, it was 90. It was 90 degrees. And and I will tell you, it didn't like to restart. I don't know. I, nice, Robert. It, it, didn't, it didn't like it. It did not like restart. It's pretty hard in the to heat. use, JK. <laughs> Your honest opinion on the 572 tabs. I think if you're a firewood cutter, I think it's, I think it, and you got the money, I think it'd be a great saw. It's a lower profile, you know, it's a, it's a lower profile than like the 372, but as far as low end power, it doesn't have the low end power that a 372 has. It doesn't have the low end power that a 372 X Torque has stock. Jay. But if you keep it wound up, if you keep it in the higher RPMs, it cuts. You all have a great day. I'm starting to get single lost. Love you all. Have a good day, William. Have a great day, William. Have a good rest of your weekend, buddy. Irks me to say I buy a 500i before I buy it. Irks me to say I buy a 500i before I buy it. And I haven't run a I haven't run a 562. I'd like to run a 562. I wish I had a 562 to run in that deck. But I have a I have a feeling that they're that they're like the same way as far as bottom end goes. I think all the new saws that with the auto tune are that way. I think it's high RPM or nothing. And then it that that comes down to that comes down to chain sharpening too. Somewhat, you know. Holding out on five seconds. Well, that twenty one seventy two will be. Yeah, they're they're a great saw. Crank bearings are terrible in the five sixty two. Did they did they change that in the in the newer models? I know they had quite a few issues when they first came out with the five sixty two. They were they were not. They had lots of flaws. Uh, that's too much for a bar. Good lord. 285 for a 32 inch bar and chain from the Husky dealer today. It was a heavy bar too. What 
what bar was it? Was it this bar? Or was it the tough light? They tried, but it didn't work. Plain gray. The X tough. Oz is it. Is it like this? Does it have this orange on it and just say husk barn on it? Oh yeah, Robert. Awesome, buddy. I can't wait to see that thing go. That's either way, even if it's the lightweight bar, that that's that's way too much. Would it be cheaper to get him on here and ship it? Oz Dad, I think you need to start a business. I think I, I think you need to start a business there. <laughs> With all the things. Try to get your hand in all the things that you can't find there. That you have to source out and get from other countries. Just start it. Just be the go-to guy in Australia for all these awesome for all the awesome parts lightweight bars chains all that this was heavy like a farmer tech bar Keep that saw forever. Heck yeah, buddy. I hope it runs. I hope it runs. I hope it runs for you, man. I hope you get it all doctored back up and cutting wood. Saw saw salvage was cheaper on the new Husky Sugi bars. My Archer bars, okay. Cause somewhere over there, you, you guys should be able to get. You should be able to get closer to the Samora <laughs> Husky Samora bars. Jay's the steel dealer. Yep. Got to spend money, Josh, to have quality stuff. Not always, Jay. Yeah, I can't imagine trying to. Oz, Dad, I can't even imagine if you're trying to get a hold of a still lightweight. Made in Australia. <clears throat> Samora. Can't get a thirty two inch archer that I've seen. The new husky bars. Yeah, it's the other it's the other way. The old goats. U.S. is Sugahara. And over in Europe is the Samora. I wish we had the Samora. Are those the they're way lighter. They're they're way lighter than the Sugahara. Why are stupid bars so Oh, expensive? my gosh. Stupid. $300? Still, it's two fifty. It's stupid. Two fifty U.S. Hold up better than anything I've ever run. Yeah, I think the Sugaharas are I, they're tougher. Oh, There's more. They're they're more rigid than a Samora. I know that for a fact. Eight. <laughs> It's, it's a steal. 
in New England with 20 inch bar, like long bars, we use 20 inch mostly. Quality junk. <laughs> 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 yeah, I wish I wish we could get the the husky Samoras. Just got up. <laughs> Maybe it needs more coffee. <laughs> well, I can't. They're moderators. <laughs> Remember, Jay? I tried to time you out all the time. I can't. All West Coast guys. Morning, Scott. Morning, Scott Wilson. How are you, buddy? <laughs> you chucking it there or are you playing? Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully he's playing. Yeah, no kidding. Works I don't know though. That over. truck he's got, that that rigging he's got is pretty dang nice, man. New trailers, man, that thing's beautiful. Number one fan, Scott. Porn rain. Maybe staying inside today. What? Time Jay out. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> Ghost. <laughs> <laughs> so gear from Stall Sawmill and lodging, logging supplies. They have the best price in the U.S. Stalls. Do they have a website? Oh, I'm sure. Jay Paris. Blog goes. <laughs> <laughs> Lord, you too. Thanks, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> Kids. Yep, got it. We got the we got the That's timeout fun. Bunch of time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're definitely definitely on the on the list. <laughs> so we'll see if that GoPro modification helps. Chat, you don't have to super chat. <laughs> Thanks, goats. <laughs> it's like it makes more of a statement. Right? Boom! <laughs> like, y'all can keep arguing, I guess. I don't have any echoes, Robert. I don't I don't have any echoes. And the only time I've ever run an echo is when my brother worked for the DNR. A long time ago, they got their setups from an echo dealer. And I ran one just a tiny bit. Other than that, I've I've never run an echo. Robert, I got a lot of echo stuff coming up. There you go. Flip caps. I like them. 
I love flip caps. Husky flip caps. Jay needs to put in a recommendation to the still outfit. <laughs> Angie, as long as they're not bothering me, I don't care what they're doing. <laughs> oh, they're not razzing you. Exactly. They can <laughs> razz each oh, other. Yeah. <laughs> We're still trying to. My old boss had, had 750 Echo. I was a kid. I ran Powerhouse back then. I like the steel flip caps, Jason. Overrated on the flip caps. <laughs> flip caps are awesome. Because they actually thread in just like a regular cap. The steel caps? I don't understand them. Do you want to go push time and cut it? I'll stand back there. I'll deal with cops and neighbors. I don't give a shit. This gas can. This is so handy. Holds all your little nice little tools and everything. <laughs> Jake, you need a Snickers, Josh. The 572 does well on fuel. If you're ever wondering if you can run av gas in one of these, you can. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> Just like that. Just like that. You can still pour oil in there with your hot rod laser on there, your turbo laser. Oiler works good. Tank for Keep her sharp. Just like that, you hear that? Yep. <laughs> That's one ready. Napalm in the morning. You know, I could smell that crap when I was mowing yesterday. I thought it was in the morning. Hot Rod 61. The 61 impressed me yesterday. I don't know. Maybe it's because I haven't run it for a while. I don't know what I don't know what it was, but it was ripping. <laughs> so it's going back to the wood pile today. Twenty six is coming along. 
couple more tanks. Ring should be seated in that bad boy. And then we'll be putting her head to head against the 350. Chuck is bad on gas. Well, it's supposed to be by a Prius. <laughs> Longer than 24 on the site, on that site. On the, on the mill, the sawmill site, 61, 28-inch bar, skip tooth. It might end up with a full house on it today, the way it was run. Husky shop showed me a brand, an LW or IW 32 yesterday. $200 cab tax. All of them. Okay, JK, geez. A branded lightweight 32 yesterday, 200 Canadian. Yeah, they're 150. 160. What, 164 or something out the door? JK, that one looks thirsty. <laughs> oh, it's thirsty. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> you don't even get warmed up. This thing's out of gas. Because I, I think the shipping is what gets you, isn't it, Oz? Because that's what this is. This is a 32. No chain, Oz. This is a 32. That is just too big. And out the door, out the door, they're 160, 164, 165. This thing is damn as tall as you are. Oh, yeah. Yep, shipping is insane at the moment. That's why I'm saying, that's why I'm saying, Ozzy. Somebody in Australia needs to uh, get in the business. 454 passes everything but a gas station. <laughs> yeah, buddy. 24 inch, 58 gauge made. For Project Pioneer for $33. Chain. Still chain? <laughs> Sounds like Canada is similar to us.
Makes you from pump four to pump five. <laughs> <laughs> Heck yeah, he's wound up. This saw is pretty th th pretty thirsty too. If who? Oh. If Farmer Tech? What are the what are the ones that Tin Man had? The Holtz Pharma. Were those thirty two? Or were those twenty eights? He got a couple of memories doing a chain test mm -hmm. and a bar test to see how the rails hold up and all that business. I can't remember if they're thirty two or not. Have you tried? Have you looked Oz for, for Holtz Forma, instead of Farmer Tech? I know it's all pretty much what I don't even know the difference or whatever. They were twenty eights. Oh, we're doing fine. Morning, y'all. Happy Turbo Saturday, Lumberjack. Lumberjack smokestack. <laughs> Morning, buddy. Uh, that's messed up, Oz. Send them home to Canada. Probably just too hot where you are. <laughs> Oz, that I bet the pizza tea is a beast. 
Osdat's got nice weather right now. Frost in the morning. I wish it was frosty. Burr, no. You were here. Oh, what did I do? I dumped it all over the floor. Shocker. Shocker. Because I didn't have the spout all the way out. You need a backup good saw so that when something happens, we all we are also good. This is cool, but not practical. I froze this morning. Oh, no, Oz. <laughs> See, that's why I want to go. That's why I want to go there when I get old and retired. Way to go, goats. What a mess. You're actually cleaning something up. No, you're just covering it. No, I'm cleaning what it up. The world? Have you ever heard of a paper towel? No, they don't work. This works much better. The oil pig. It soaks it up. Yeah. When right. I pull that off there later, it'll be gone. You'd be like, Shh, where did it go? It's like magic. We'll see, sir. Sir. I'm going to get you, see? I'm going to get you, see? Smash my 390, JK. Waiting on parts. Okay, I'm fixing this right now. Maybe. He's on Facebook, the Indiana Doggos. Yeah. We are cool. Doug Philbeck. <sighs> yeah, Jay, I got to take this still to keep all them huskies in line. Wait, wait. <laughs> Morning, Evan. Goats, I sent Oz a link to um, Doug's Facebook channel. <laughs> it's 
early, JK. They said all the there's a Doug's channel. Cool. Ready to rock. Straight from the jug, what is it? Question mark. He has, what now? Straight from the jug, what is that? Straight from the jug. Which jug? We got jugs everywhere. This one? County line, bar and chain on the wall. I don't, I need to be more bubbly. <laughs> even know me, JK? Is, is, that, is that what you meant, JK? More oil is can right now. Oil. 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 <laughs> yes, he said. Yeah, that's, it's just oil. oil. <laughs> just barrel, barrel, barrel. <laughs> that's, 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 uh, that's Canadian. As for as French Canadian and Kentuckian, Kentuckian, all in one barrel. Why he took the spout off? Oh, <laughs> that and that and this is a little bit thinner oil. This is a little bit thinner oil. Goes says it sounded straight up like Boston. <laughs> 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 Excited, bubbly. Did you get hit on the head? <laughs> right, lumberjack. I don't think I'm ever bubbly. Yes, you are. Bubbly does not fit this. Bubbly, I'm sending <laughs> someone for a welfare check. <laughs> right? <laughs> Absolutely, Kim. <laughs> Where is Bubbly? <laughs> the He's not. <laughs> oh my God, God. My drink. <laughs> Kim. Never the jug. That's funny, but not funny. You know what I mean? Right. On that, effervescent. There we go. Now, okay, here, now we're getting official. What is that word? Effervescent. What's that? Bubbly. It's another word for bubbly. That's Fizzy. Fizzy. Mind drink. Classy. Effervescent. Classy. But still voted, right? <laughs> She's got the fizz. That one was pushing the PG thirteen line. <laughs> right? Fuse lit. fuse lit. I need more coffee uh, too. I need more coffee. <laughs> <laughs> right there with you. Get it, fuse lit. Get it. Right, goes. <coughs> <coughs> Saws are ready. I think everybody wants to go see the log deck. Look at my new special 390XT vid Taz. You got. <laughs> will you just post it for Oz? He's been asking for like over a week. Why even do it? Right on, JK. Right? I know Oz, that. I know. Get black on that and you will. 
there are 15 people <laughs> and 10 thumbs up. Thanks, goats. Someone tell me why this. <laughs> Showing 17. <laughs> uh, my ne it never updates who's all in and in the thumbs up on my stupid machine. Well, all I know is, I know I shouldn't say anything, but I'm gonna. <laughs> this earlier time frame, my camera hasn't messed up yet. Didn't mess up last weekend. Didn't mess up, hasn't messed up yet today. So, I mean... It's just got to do with the connection, is what I come up with. When everybody wakes up and everybody's on it, everybody's on it, whatever, you know. Well, and Mountain Man had trouble on his last live feed. Yeah. Like, bad. It was just as bad as... Yeah, Friday. Friday afternoon. Yeah. Everybody's just getting off work. Right. Flooding the system. Well, that's people burning your van. Yeah, fuse lit. That's what I think. Yeah. I like the other time myself, but it's not 5 a.m. here either. <laughs> right. Yeah, goats. Yeah. And it's not as hot either. No, it isn't, JK. Kenny hasn't had a spammer in his live chats in a very long time. It's weird. He's loading all of this crap up in the pickup. If y'all wondered. That sounds fun, Johnny. Johnny's road trip taking the family to West Jefferson. Tired of being hot. Motel with a pool and good eats. Awesome. Go, Johnny, go. Uh, how it starts off. Go, Johnny, go, go, go. <laughs> good morning, Andrew. Yes, Kim, we're going to the log deck. It's like two blocks away not very long of a road trip <clears throat> I'm gonna have to go change my clothes I'm gonna have to put shorts on True, goats. I haven't seen them either. Oh, God. What's Jay sending me now? <laughs> Ready to rock. Oh, I don't need to look professional, JK. I'll just throw wood for a little while. <laughs> yeah, Jay, we didn't know you left. <laughs> that's the 881 and Janelle. I know, that's so funny. Here. Y'all want to see. I 
I think you've probably seen this one before. Yep. There's Janelle. <laughs> Casterman messages showed up. Casterman? Everybody's saying hi. Morning, buddy. Kim, love your hat, Taz, man. I was wondering if somebody <laughs> noticed, noticed, yeah. that, noticed that thing. These things are just terrible. I just hate them. Why don't you just get a pack of glass cleaner wipes? Why don't I just throw them away? We have... Windex in the house. I'm not Windex in my sunglasses. <laughs> Why? I have glass cleaner. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, then you throw them in the damn. Hey, 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 hey. I'm just saying. <laughs> just saying. <laughs> you wipe them and then you throw them in the crap you have on the bench. You have to acting live now to see them skills. Ray bands. No, we just <laughs> oh pit vipers, pit vipers. No, <laughs> Windex, Mama Taz, eyes <laughs> dirty. <laughs> I like the glass cleaner better. Call me so don't look at me like that. All right. Ready? No, when we're heading, because I need to go change. Huh? Let me know when we're heading back there so I can go change. Well, you might as well go change, because we're going to be headed back there pretty soon. Pit vipers, heck yes. No, JK. Those things are fucking noxious. <laughs> Charlie had, well, she had. Right, Andrew? Good morning, Andrew. Don't look at me. That one. <laughs> No, I'm wearing shorts. Get your saw pants on. No, I'm not sawing anything. <coughs> <laughs> and don't start with me, Jay. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how long it'll last down there. Saw pants for the win. You can wear chaps over shorts. It's cool. <laughs> Thank you, Phenom. I sleep in my saw pants. <laughs> Socks and Crocs. <laughs> I do that sometimes, go. Got my spare laser, my Allen wrench for adjusting so we can put it on a different saw if we want to. Secret is to wear laced boots. Shout out to Phenom. Absolutely, Johnny Arnett. Laser, I missed something. We have a laser on the on the saw for measuring wood cutting length for customers that like their wood, you know, that maybe finicky or whatever about their wood length <clears throat> instead of using a stick <clears throat> we got a laser from an awesome subscriber and it's on the 572 this morning we're gonna try it out oh yeah
Well, you guys are going to get to see the first cuts with it. That's what we're going to do when we first get down there. Taking this 16 inches long, and we're going to see how close, we're going to see how it works. Tape and a lumber crayon. Well, JK, maybe this laser will save you some time, right? Save you some time. Won't have to carry this around. Won't have to carry your chalk around. Won't have to worry about forgetting your chalk. I mean, it all works. And like I said, Travis has got a good video on a marking stick with a screw in it. It's got a screw in it, and it's got a crayon in, in one end. Crayon in this end, screw in this end, and you adjust whatever, you know, whatever length you want. With this, you know, with the screw and whatever. And Oh, yeah. He's got a great video on how to make it, how, how it works. His original style that he had, and then he modified it to make it easier, to make it better, more user-friendly, I guess you could say. Yeah, 307. Juke. Go check it out. Customer right in the eye and tell them to quit complaining. <laughs> Not picky about the length but my tiny Joe Tool 602 is. I don't care if you're <laughs> Oh, goats, always have a tape with me. <laughs> yeah, because if this thing, if, it, if you can get it, you know, set up right, it's just going to be cut, 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 cut. sunshine in my life my dear friend oh that's awesome phenom i love that connection connection is pretty strong around this joint just for me use my loggers tape and spray paint and make the line but for someone else then i'll use the stick yeah that's what i do all right chippy good morning buddy Crayon is in wedge pouch too. Nice, JK. A couple hours sleep. Good to go. Yeah, Aaron, when I'm cutting my own wood, I don't mark nothing. I just cut it. Because if it's too short, I have, a, I have a special spot for it right behind my door on the other shed. So my door will open. I put shorter wood there in a certain set in that little section where the door's at, so the door will open all the way. With my up against my last rick of wood when I put my wood in. And if it's too long, I'll either I'll burn it out at the spear fire. So it don't matter. We got lost without our GPS. <laughs> okay, with rounds. Coming out between 13 and 16, so I don't measure. That's right, Lumberjack. Oh, boy. She... <laughs> Bad reviews for Kim Star. <laughs> I know talking crap. No. Chippy got lost without his GPS. <laughs> that doesn't surprise me. He gets lost with the GPS. So much energy. Mama Taz sent you a video. What? Chippy said he sent you a video. Oh, God. And what? Well, let's go down there. Let's go see if this is going to work. Hey, should we? Is that a, is that a yes vote from, from everybody? Is it unanimous? Yeah. 
Are you driving down? Yeah. You ain't putting crap in my car. Okay. I'll be right back. I'll take this last handful of stuff, get it in the truck, and then I'll come back. Get you. Let's get at it, JK <laughs> Are you going to need this other phone? Huh? Are you going to need this? I don't, I don't know. Turn out the lights, the party's over. Your what? That's up to you, dear. Twenty-seven thumbs up. Thanks, everybody. I appreciate that. That's awesome. You guys rock. Early in the morning. You people are awesome. You know that. Anybody tell you that yet today? Well, I'm telling you now. Think we're ready? Eh? Is on in here, come crying in the back stretch. Hard eggs are going to the inside. My tears are holding back to I'm not falling. Firing up the Yoda. <laughs> is the screen clean or is it dirty? <laughs> Let's go. 28 thumbs up. Look at that. Look at us go, you guys. You guys are awesome. Sorry, I'm just getting in the old yoder here. I don't stand, you guys. Wish I could put you right there. You right there for a second. Hang it right there. Let's go. That ain't gonna work. Maybe. Let's go check out the log deck. Rewind. <laughs> Crystal clear, he said. 29. It's going to get bright in a minute. I'm going to try to keep you from having the sun right in your eyeballs.
hippie chi. <laughs> Here comes the glare, sorry. Try to not be in it very long. Morning, Zachary. Uh, hopefully, mom. I don't. Oh man, I forgot my charger. It might not last very long. I don't know. We'll see. We shall see. Let's go look at this lock deck. Some nice firewood. Look at all that beautiful wood. Some nice firewood. I'm on it yesterday. Yes, yes, that was awesome. Singing happy birthday. Here's what we got left. It's pretty nice wood. Pretty nice wood. Wish there was a spot in the shade I could put you guys. I don't know how much battery life I got left. Did you bring your cord? No. I didn't. I forgot it. And I didn't realize it until I just pulled in. There you go. Because I can go get an extension cord. I don't know how to tell. Tell what? What are we telling? Just enough batteries. <laughs> Winnipeg, Manitoba. Are we there yet? J Fairs. Backup cord for in your truck. 61 first. 61 first? Why don't you run home and get your cord and I'll work on getting an extension cord out here? Well, we don't want everybody sitting here. I love my 61. Hey, John, how's it going, honey? They don't care. You ain't going to be gone long. Just leave a saw run, we won't be good. <laughs> Jade, hush your butt. <laughs> mm. 
morning, JC. Oh, good Lord, Jay. There's not a lot of shade out here for his phone. for my car being clean. What? <laughs> Do what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm just thinking that somehow there's for shade. Oh, yeah, there is none. Well, unless we put you <clears throat> Chippy Chippy donated $20 Old school Old school for the 61 You do realize the camera's that way Old school Could you put them right there? Like on a piece of wooden shade, a little bit. Where's the shade? The shade. Where do you want it? Well, you, you won't be able to see anything. What if you park your pickup over there and leave them on the tailgate? Then I'll get like an umbrella or something. Like park it over there so the sun's this way. So the the sun's not in there at all. Well, I know, that's where I gotta put it anyway. I know, so if you back your pickup over there. You wanna do that? Oh, stop! Oh my god. <laughs> you just ran over a spray can. I did? Yeah. What? It fell off the tailgate. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> yeah.
doing? And of course, it was a brand new one. Uh huh. Brand new. Calm down. Good lord. Well, hopefully the laser works today. We don't have to worry about it. Right? Right. There, how's that? Should be super chatted twenty dollars.
Did we freeze up? Parked my car right here too. I don't know how much cord I got. What, dear? See those two drop logs drop down a bit. Oh yeah, that's the fun. That's the fun of cutting in a log deck. It's paying attention to what's moving around you, right? Oh, well, we'll try the 572 with the laser. We'll try to get the laser set up.
that pop open? Which cop was that close? What, how do you, where do you put your dumb phone at? How can you tell it's charging? See that? Who's got that boat?
Pretty good. Works pretty good.
JC, good morning. Somebody's coffee's kicking in. Well, we're getting a pile of wood anyway, huh? We want to keep going? Or do we want to shut it down? <laughs> Mama Chaz says shutting up. <laughs> Should be going live. What? Well, we still got 15 people here, so should we cut a little bit more? Let's run that tank out in the 572 and then we'll then we'll talk about it.
lot of gas. <laughs> Break time. Laser off. <laughs> oh yeah, she's out. There's water in the back of the car. See what I mean about fuel mileage? Are we messed up? No. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, there we go. I wasn't keeping up with the comments. <laughs> Hydrate break, Mama Taz, Scott Wilson said. More like smoke break, I can't be. Kim Wilson says, you wouldn't know by the way you were Hucking those rounds, Mama. It's all that aggression I get from listening to Jay's crap all the time. Well, so now everybody knows, everybody that's here knows, about, you know, how long a tank of fuel goes in a 572 when you're just cutting. Sure, there was some idle time in there in between here and there, but... It's to be expected you should do that with your chainsaw anyway. I do, anyway. Helps them cool off a little bit. Wish that breeze would pick up about five miles an hour. Rain. Mm-hmm. Rain would be nice. Uh, yeah, I don't know, goats. It's, it was, I mean, in your guys' world, is that is that cotton? Is that like, you know what I mean? There's some, there's some, there's wood there. For sure. A cord, a tank. Yeah, that's, that's, um, like my, my 372 X Torque. And my 64 also. You guys better stay hydrated out there, Kevin says. I'm about to get a sprinkler going. I wonder if that works over there. I don't know, but it'd be nice if it was going and blow a little bit this way. Yeah, about a quarter tank is is what uh, that's what my my old my 570 it did that also. Um. <laughs> The Taz XP and the 390 X Taz, those saws are thirstier. <laughs> the 390, yeah, the 390 is is super thirsty. It, it cuts a Toyota load, which is right at oh, it's half cord. Torque equals thirsty. That's right, goats. Taz, you would be. <laughs> yeah, that 572, that, that thing, you know, when you're just cutting it, it does, it does real well on fuel. Even like falling a tree, and limbing it and bucking it and all that it's uh it, it does it does really good my saw and we can race awesome come on goats <laughs> by design i don't i think so you don't run out of oil before you run fuel out yeah it's tank for tank Problem with the mounted marker. You don't get a break while someone else marks for the next cuts. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Kevin. It's it's uh 
it, it's all going. It, it's, uh, you know, you, it's just cut, 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 which is, which is super nice because then you just fuel up, your saw cools off a little bit, get a drink of water. I thought, oh, I'll run a tank of fuel out, you know, and then I'll get watered up. Well, I think I should take a break, half tank, with the 572 anyway, as much wood. It, that thing, it just, I don't know, it works pretty well. But as you can see, this isn't, this isn't huge wood either. This right here, I think, was where the 562 would, would really shine. High RPM, super sharp chain, just in light, lighter than the 572, you know. Pick up a 60 inch bar so I can reach the top of the pile. Yep, we just square them all up and just let her eat. <laughs> well, Mama Tad, she's, she's getting after it now. She's trying to get a sprinkler set up. Isn't that a beautiful view though? That wood pile? Look at all that wood. That's not a very good hose. Exactly. I'm just razzing you, buddy. You have forgotten more about cutting than I'll never know. <laughs> Get those axes going. I'm gonna let the kids do all the splitting on this. I'm gonna let them enjoy it. <clears throat> it would be great testing grounds though, wouldn't it, Casterman? <laughs> Great testing ground. Some tamarack and fur. Tamarack and fur is all this pile is. Doug fur and, well, Western Arch. Whatever you want to call it. Looks like work, Taz. It's fun, though. It's not work. My phone's not getting hot. water I did get a little break in there though using that awesome PV man that thing's handy it's so nice it's light it's fairly short stout Oh yeah, it's perfect. Yeah, Casterman. All oh, right, on Kevin. I'm glad you like that. Well, should we shut her down? Oh, I won't shut it down yet.
Do you have your vents open on your pants? Yep. They're always open on these. <laughs> Cashman says your pants look too hot. Huh? Cashman said your pants look too hot. And that shade for the phone. Well, I'll tell you this. These saw pants may be warm, but just imagine having pants and chaps on. No thanks. Pass. Been there. Did that. Not for me. Not for me. I wish I would have had these saw pants back when I was thinning. Would have been a whole lot less of this. <laughs> I could move them back there. Kind of run out of shade. I'll put them behind the car maybe. Yeah, what would be wrong with that? I was There's shade for days back here, eh? Mint! Daisy Dukes coming in the merch store. <laughs> Customer wants Daisy Dukes in the merch store, dear. Casterman Dukes on them? Casterman Dukes? <gasps> it can happen. Thank you, Phenom. Well, what should we do? Cut? Go swimming in the pool? Or shut her down? Should we shut the live down? Go swimming in the pool. 15 people. It's only 8 o'clock. Goat says cut. <laughs> Casterman says I'm a ride off. <laughs> Go out for coffee, Kim Wilson says. Uh, an iced coffee, maybe. Cut some. Joe, where's your chainsaw? What's that? Where's your chainsaw? <laughs> uh, <electric> <laughs> you gotta be shitting me. Snowballs. For, yeah, phenom snowballs. Or your, or your gloves or something. <laughs> JK. What are you doing? What's that? What are you doing? I gotta go get my big old toolbox. Oh. Must stay hydrated. Yes, Kim Wilson. Let them run the 390X Taz. Well, let's run the 390 a little bit. Let's warm it up. Let's cut a log with the 390. <laughs>
Is Ozdat still here by chance? He's gonna be so wound up he misses this. That. Yeah, buddy, here you go.
Pretty sweet, JK. What do you think, buddy? What do you think? I'm gonna sit down for a minute. That's what I think. Okay. I'm taking a break. I am taking a break. Do we have any... Look at that fuzz. <laughs> we got 19 people. We picked up four four more from last time I was on. What, what do we got going on? Oh, sorry. I'll switch aside. Sorry. This isn't normal, right, folks? Nothing so, normal. so, what, what? Whoa, 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 whoa. Something else went up, too. What? Who did that? Who did that? I hope it's still here. You guys got to tell me what's going on. If I don't find it, you got to tell me. Because it's not on my screen. Mama Taz logging boot fun. Casterman, $10. Is that what you were looking for? Casterman, Mama Taz logging boot fund. Casterman. T thank you, Casterman. And somebody else. Casterman did another $10 before that. He, Casterman did two? 20 yeah. Jay Daniels? What? Jay Daniels made it in? Yeah. Oh, Jay Daniels, awesome. Sorry, I'm, I'm, you guys would much rather watch somebody cut, right, than just sit here and yap into the camera. I don't know. I'll sit here and yap. I don't know, but... So throw wood. JK, talk to me. <laughs> That's with the dual port muffler and an 8-pin sprocket. That 8-pin sprocket, I'm going to tell you right now. I ran it, I ran it with that muffler with 7-pin. And now I ran it with that eight pin. Yep, it needs that eight pin. It it pulls. It is pulling, and that stock chain. The rakers ain't been touched. Nothing. I've cut. I've cut over two cords of wood on that chain. Yeah. Hot. Fell a tree and cut over two and have cut over two cords of wood with that on that chain <laughs> on that very chain, untu untouched. So you know I'm your funny. So it might be a little bit, it might be a little bit ragged, but it is, it is a stock X cut chain with that much wood cut on it. It needs another gear. It got another gear. That eight, that eight pin gave it to it. And with the rakers, if I put, if I pulled the rakers down on that and gave her a little touch up with one of them smooth, smooth, still files. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, I can't, I can't take it. I got to go to the sprinkler. 
<laughs> Mama, Mama Taz is like when she was a kid, gonna go run in the sprinkler. <laughs> oh yeah. Did you just film me? I did, absolutely. <laughs> My 395 is coming with a 10 pin. Jay, you missed the 390. Sprinklers are for everyone. JK, JK, come on. Seriously. Seriously. Talk to me. This is what JK does, and then he looks like all oh, he's sweating. <laughs> oh, yeah, goats. <laughs> <laughs> the pile's getting smaller, huh? No, it isn't. Oh, yeah, it is. No, it isn't. I looked. Oh, it's a lot There's smaller. There's still 40 freaking cords left. It's 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 a lot smaller. <laughs> RPM and loses very little. That's why I wanted to get to that big log on top, that bigger log on top. You know, it's not huge, but... Oh, Jay's back. Thank yeah, God. it didn't lose it didn't lose much. Thank God I brought my car, huh? So so to the builders out there <coughs> to all the builders out there If you if you watch if you watch videos if you watch enough videos you'll notice it you'll notice it. it it will lose some rpms when it takes off when you when you get in the cut but it'll stay there right until the bar until you're at the biggest piece of wood and you have the most chain in the wood and you will hear every single saw pull down in the real world. Not in the hot saw world, none of that business. I'm talking wood cutters, tree cutters, <laughs> you let you watch, you uh, go see it for yourself. So to the builders, build a saw, build your saws, try to build your saws to not do that. Because think about it, if you lose RPM, when it's at the biggest part of the wood, which you're, you, you've got the most chain in the wood, right? When do you need the most bar oil? Right then. And as you lose RPM, you lose bar oil. So if you can build your saw to not lose RPM, it'll lose RPM, like I said, in the beginning of the cut to get down to its settling spot. But then they lose a little bit more in that longer cut and they don't pick back up until you're in less wood. Keep that RPM all the way through the cut. If it drops down, when you put it to the wood and it, if it drops down to 10,000 RPMs, it's, <laughs> get it to stay at 10,000 RPMs all the way through the piece of wood. Then you will be getting your maximum oil when you need it, when you have the most chain in action being used. Pulling, right? Oh my God, it's only 8.30. And you're doing this for how long? There's got to be a way around it. <laughs> There's got to be. Why do I have bird seed in my car? Home light, home lights. Kind of, home lights kind of got it in a lot of the, in some of their saws. They got it figured out. They got it figured out. <laughs> they lose that initial RPM, but they stay right there throughout no, the whole cut. No, Jay, never. Let's all head to Mom and Taz's house. Somebody start <laughs> cooking and someone make cold drink for her. <laughs> Smile, Corey. Be happy. No. Nitrous. <laughs> yeah, <it's true. laughs> the turbo. Where's my shade go? I don't know nothing about building saws, but that's a, that's from a, from a guy that runs them. That that's a something. <sighs> a 
ram air. How much fuel did we use? Hopefully you're out. I can't believe it didn't run out. <laughs> it's pretty darn close. <laughs> Yeah, this is a start at five in the morning thing. I know, I wish I could. I'd do it anyway. <clears throat> I think it's working great. <laughs> it's pulling. We get them rakers down just a tiny bit and get our edge back on there. Oh, it'll really rip. Probably one more tank through the old 572 and we'll be done. We'll get on it. Daylight's burning. <laughs> no 10 pin. I'm not going 10 pin. There's no way. If I go 10 pin, then I got to shorten my chain and my bar ain't as long and I'm not doing it. Buy a longer bar. <laughs> I'm not do I don't need it. That that's all I don't need no ten pin. That ten pin would nope. You're scared. Too much. Eight pin that eight pin that eight pin made a big difference. It really did on that. Why has nobody cut that tree down? It's all probably leaning towards the house or something. Well, I want it down, <laughs> not oh it's gonna fall on my house. People are dumb. My car puts out a lot of shade. It does, it works good. Get after it, Mama, he said. Who? JJ. <laughs> <laughs> of course he did. It's not as hot as it was yesterday. You're not throwing heavy wood. Yeah, I'm not yeah, I'm not having to do that part. Yeah. I can't Or mark it. Well, a lot of those are too big. I can't even hardly roll them. If I had your wood hook. It's in the pickup. I was just, Jesus. Don't grab a hold of one of them big ones, though, unless you got your footing. Because if it sticks, it's going to pull you wherever it's going. <laughs> well, that would make entertainment. <laughs> no, it wouldn't. Trips to the hospital are not entertainment. Uh, <laughs> she's perfect. <laughs> JK. Will you step on that so I don't start a fire? Mm-mm. You want to start a fire? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, nobody else did yet this year around here, so we might as well be the first. Yeah, Pick a room. Nice as Mama has to get the... <laughs> it dropped a little here. Oh, it stays there. Where's my water? It pulls through it, for sure. Did you just drink all my water? I sure did. Oh my god. I thought it was mine from early. No, I drank mine from all of mine. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Thanks, Mama. Jesus. Oh, this one's chilly. It's been in the shade on the ground. I'm going to get real cold once in the office. Mm hmm. But I have to walk around because they locked the middle door. Oh. Blood pump. <laughs> well, we gotta get that wood out of the way first, though. Yeah, you do. Well, and the pile's getting taller, so it's, I have to throw it up higher. No, you don't. Yes, I do. Nope. It needs to be as the bottom goes in, you don't way. have to throw it as high. You don't have to throw it as far. You just start a new level. I don't mind throwing from that end because the sprinkler's down there. Should I get it off the wood? Probably. Why? It'll freaking dry out today. If we had a breeze, I'd put it with the wind and, you know, get the full effect going. So now what are you, are you, what are you doing?
switch this thing. Is that how we do it? Crap. Stupid car.
I know, I left it there for a reason. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. All right, you guys really want to watch this? <laughs> 15 people still here? Talk to me. Talk to me. Are we good? Gatorade. <laughs> H2O. We're going to keep going. One more. One more stretch. I needed this outside time. Yeah, I like to sweat my ass off. JT, <laughs> 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 we're good. We're talking. Let's do one more and then be done for the day. Thank you, Phenom. All right, 15 people. We're gonna run the 572 some more. Let's go. I'm not into that. You want me to start it? I'm not into that. I ain't falling to that business. At all. Remember when I said that earlier? Yeah. Not for me. Uh-uh. That right there is a deal breaker. That's a deal breaker for me. Okay, come on now.
It's a 61, JK. for a minute. Stock 61. Just a muffler mod, huh? Oh, yeah. Shade. It's a great firewood saw. Wow. Back to the shade. Crap. I don't know how to run his stupid phone. That was a good stretch. Hey? <laughs> There's 15 people here still. You people are awesome. Well, I wish they were really here. No kidding. Oh, we'd be done. We'd be done, right? Yeah. Woodcutter. Thanks for coming, Woodcutter. Four hours, holy smokes, you guys. Two hours in the shack, two hours cutting. It's only been two hours. At least there's some action, mm -hmm. right? Not just... 6.25 an hour, Casterman says. <laughs> You're already fired. Pile is going down. 
Yeah, the old 61. Don't do too bad. <laughs> I'm watching with my ears. Just cleaning up the old truck for the cart. Sweet, Jake. Eh? Time yet. Looking good there, brother. Hey, Billy! Good to see you, Billy. Thanks for coming, buddy. Awesome. Yeah, what do we got left? Do it. Too much. I think I snorted some sawdust. Seriously. What's up? I think I snorted some sawdust. Oh yeah. <laughs> Weird. Being at nice wood, wood cutter. <coughs> it's a stupid weather temp. It is nice wood. It is not 79 degrees. That, it's not that hot. That app lies. It's not that hot today. That app's wrong. It's nowhere near as hot today as it was yesterday at this time, I'm telling you. That one's a 72. That's <clears throat> crap. John Hudson. Johnny Hudson. Nothing but chainsaws. Look at these people piling. We got 40 thumbs up. 19 people now. Snorting sawdust puts hair. I don't need any of that, Casterman. If that, uh, if that 572 would run, I'd go another round right now. <laughs> See what I mean, though? Yeah, the restart, the restart situation. I, I'm not into that. Jay Daniel said to take the mall to it. I oh, if it, <laughs> if, if I owned it, it it well, it, it'd probably still be sitting in the shed. It's not after your yesterday because it did the same thing to me yesterday. It's not your saw. No. Who's this? Tony's. It's, Tony's. it's a loaner saw. Take it back. So that's my that that's my that that's the worst thing that I've dealt with between that and that bog right off the bottom is not real impressive when, when, you know when you've run a saw that that doesn't do that bog and when you've run a saw that you know like the 61 how long has the 61 been sitting there sure i had to re-choke it but Remember, you're not it plugged. started you're not i don't know what it is it doesn't make any sense Makes no sense. Well, come on down, woodcutter. You can help cut some wood. I don't know what it is, and, and really, I, I I really don't care. <laughs> <laughs> because, no. Porter's if there was ever any idea, any thought that even <laughs> went through my head that I might want to buy one of those, Jade that would have ruined it. Funny. But there was no thought. I, I no. Ported saws and sixty one <clears throat> spoil you. That sixty one's no slouch. <laughs> It's no slouch. I wouldn't go fall big timber with it, but I'll cut firewood right here in this log deck. Oh my God. All day. I forgot to turn the salt on. Now. Need a 500 eye, my friend. Okay. Maybe if we win the lotto. Yeah, no kidding. Right? <laughs> 61 is my go to mostly. Are we done? I'll start rolling up. Yeah, I suppose we better stop.
You hear that weed eater? Or somebody's trying to weed eat. Oh, God. We got 20 people here. Well, take them. They can come home and we'll have a pool party. <laughs> <laughs> That thing needs a little help. Yeah, just imagine if you were out cutting firewood. Just imagine if you were out on the mountain. If I was out on the mountain cutting firewood and that's the only saw I had. And I got to wait. <laughs> no. <laughs> no way. Not that, it, you know, not that something can't happen to a normal saw, but... It, not that. <clears throat> That's one reason why I always take two saws with me. Always. It won't start. <laughs> I ran it, shut it off, then I ran the 390. Tried to restart it. Won't restart. It's got a brain cramp or something. <laughs> I do not know. I do not know computerized business. I'm pretty much I'm pretty much ignorant to it. What's that noise? Your neighbors know we're shooting a video. <laughs> yeah, Jay. <laughs> that was somebody running a weed eater over there. <laughs> hmm. That sun's coming around. Unplug it and plug it back in. <laughs> I'm going to put it in the back of the pickup. <laughs> That's what I'm going to do with it. Awesome. Well, thanks for hanging out with us, everybody. Two of two has already happened. <laughs> the future of two. The future of two stroke. The fuel injection. White top. JK's got a white top 61. Well, fuel injection, fuel injection has changed the two-stroke world and everything else. Snowmobiles. You can visit at home in the shade. Let's get out of here. Well, I'm just going to get off here. Okay. Well, whatever. It's hot. It's stupid. Plan to retire, but burnout got me first. Awesome, everybody. Well, I'm going to end it. Thanks, everybody, for hanging out. Thanks, Super Chatters. Thanks, Moderators. Thanks, everybody, for commenting, coming here, supporting, checking in. Love it. 572 runs good when it's running. But I'm not going to sit there and pull on it for an hour. That ain't me. <laughs> <clears throat> Great wood, great cut and saw. And smaller stuff, you know. They do work well. Well, I got sawdust on me. What happened? Oh. 
Yeah, JK, thanks, buddy. That 390 that you built, it does run good. That's for sure. It keeps pulling. <laughs> I can't wait to fall more big fur with it. Thank you, Healed Heart. Happy birthday. Thanks for hanging out with us for so long on your birthday. Appreciate it. Right. We go, love it. Go have a nice fun day. Yeah. Yeah. Go live at the pool. <laughs> you know, I have one of these. Will that clamp onto that? What, what is it? It's an umbrella. <laughs> clamp onto your tripod? Yeah, it would. I don't know how well it would do, Throw some ideas at it. I think it's where it needs to be. I think it needs just a little bit hungrier chain. <laughs> Thank you, Kevin. Mm -hmm. Thanks for coming. Thanks, Phenom. Placeholder. <laughs> Majestic Hunter. And where's that rugged timber at? Gotta run. Thanks for hosting us, Taz, Mama Taz. Everyone, be safe. Thank you, Kevin. Thanks for your support, brother. We love you. Could always drop that 572 at the dumpsters. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Casterman. Thanks, Woodcutter, for coming. Appreciate it. Any of the new subscribers that hung out with us, we appreciate it. We love you all. Old Blue, buddy, where you at? I'll take a second. I think they should be home by Monday. Majestic Hunter, yeah, buddy. <laughs> -hoo -hoo. Yes, I love it. Yeah. Good to see you, old blue. Tell Wind Windrider we said hi. <laughs> I'm sure she's right there. Hi, Windrider. Southern Maine. Awesome. Roll on, Tasmaniacs. Thanks, everybody, for your support. Thanks for chilling out with us. <laughs> Love y'all. Be kind. Let's go look at the wood pile one more time. <laughs> Pretty nice wood, huh? Oh, yeah. That was a good stretch. We love y'all. Let's end right on the wood pile. That'll make a good, that'll make a good picture for somebody. Just wood. Love y'all. See you on the next one.